to downgrade, we need to download iOS 13.5 from ipsw.me. Model number, model number, go settings, about this one, 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 Connect the iPhone with the iTunes and now go there. It's take syncing right now. After it finished, you have to control check updates and then go to find where you download that. Attach. Select the one you download for iPhone and then update. It will take a lot of time. So I forward it. It now is almost over. 3.97 GB of 3.97. Still working on it. Now you can see that it's 13.5.1. And it's still working on that but in iTunes it said that it's already downloaded so let it be yep so it's good to go I just go and regular setup again so I can you can start it as a new phone or just from the backup too is fine will take it from there I just use it from my iCloud so I just put my iCloud credentials and when I logged in back all my apps because I back up too so everything was so I just want to verify and after this it will just go from the backup from my iCloud right now it's updating my settings terms and conditions so again is asking from the to choose the backup now it's ready to go and you can see that welcome to iPhone and now it's iOS 13.5.1 just go to settings about and you can see that software version 13.5.1 if you like the video please share and subscribe to my channel